Hello ladies, today I have a look. It's this one right here. It's um using the LA Colors palette in Aquatic Paradise. <clears throat> excuse me. And on my lid, <clears throat> excuse me, uh, that yellow shade. It's that bright yellow one right there. And for the outer V, I used this um, e.l.f. in Coffee Bean. It's um, one of the mineral, I mean, excuse me, one of the studio singles. It looks like this. I already primed my eyes with the Jordana Eyelid Primer. So, I'm gonna begin now. Took this e.l.f. eyeshadow brush and take some of this yellow. Take some of that yellow from the LA Colors Aquatic Paradise palette. I'm going to be placing that on my lid. These palettes are really nicely pigmented. These colors are really, really nice. I'm quite happy with that. Actually, at first, as I was doing this eye, I actually got scared when I saw this. But you can't go around life always being afraid. It's just makeup. Right? Okay. And we're done with that. Now, I will be taking this detail brush. And I will be taking that um, Studio Line Elf Single Eyeshadow in Coffee Bean. These shadows are loose. And I'm going to place this along my lash line. And I'm going to be making an outer V with this Coffee Bean. Make sure it matches up with the other, the other eye. See, I like to mix and match these eyeshadows sometimes. Take different brands and that's how you find out what brand works good with what. Because not everything looks good, you know, together. But you find your little you know, little tips and tricks. Um, I already did the highlight, and this is Jordana Winter White, as usual. Um, I also tight line already with the clean color in dark brown. Looks like that. I finally sharpened it, yes. Actually, I didn't line my lower lid. Just get that out the way now. Voila. Because I still have to do my upper lash line. Oh, I'll just do it now. And this is with the clean color pencil. These pencils are like nice and smooth, very creamy. I, I really enjoy the clean color pencils. Eyeliner pencils, their lip liner pencils are also very good. Quite good, also. Don't you just hate awkward angles? <laughs> I'm gonna bring that in a little. Okay, should be just about done. That looks good. Um, tight line a little bit again. Okay, 
and that's <clears throat> excuse me. And there you have that. Then I'm gonna take um, this Elf blending brush, crease brush, and I'm gonna go into that coffee bean from Elf. Oof, these shadows are very loose. And we're gonna go into that outer V. Like that. I'm gonna have to bring it in a little. Blend that out. And do the same in this eye, of course. And blend that. Blend, blend, blend. So far, so good. Just need to tap it more in the corner. The Studio Line single um, eyeshadows, they're very smooth. They're loosely um, packed, but it's all right. It's all good. You know, as long as you tap your brush, I don't think you should have any trouble with fallout. Because that's what I always do. Tap my brush. And on mascara, I have this e.l.f. <clears throat> excuse me, lengthening and defining. Mascara has the glitters in it, but you can't see the glitter, so I don't care. Um, what's that gonna do now? Oh, yes. Get the highlight color. Blend this out a little. I didn't put any more product on the brush that I use for the winter white. And I'll be taking that um mascara, the e.l.f. mascara, on oh, my nails. For a base and top coat, I have this quick dry top coat. Got this at Dollar Store. It's a two pack. And I have this Sinful Colors nail polish on today. And this is in Let Me Go. It's a dual chrome. It's very beautiful. Very beautiful. Okay, now where are we? The mascara. Yes. I like brushes like this. I really like these brushes. Long and slim. And I'm gonna coat these lashes so they can look like these. <laughs> Stretch these babies up and out. Oh, when I was younger, my eyelashes were so long, like my kids' eyelashes. They were so thick and long. Darn it. <laughs> oh, what can you do? That's what mascara's for. When all else fails, when in doubt, when in doubt. <laughs> do the lower lash line as well. Hope them babies also. They need love too. I was gonna use my e.l.f. jumbo cream shadow stick in yellow. I'm so glad I did not. This would have really been loud, this yellow. And I think it's already kinda out there, but oh well. <laughs> what can you do? And it never fails. I always get myself with the mascara. <clears throat> mm -hmm. It never fails, ladies. <sighs> That's why you keep a rag on your lap. 
<laughs> I got a rag of washcloth. Old washcloth that you don't need anymore. Always handy for wiping the brushes, also for quick clean. So, yeah. Now, all I have to do after this is my hair. And I'm done and I'm good and I can go. It is nice and warm out today. I see people wearing shorts and tank tops and stuff. So, yeah. These outer lashes always give me a hard time. But I will have pics at the end of this video, of course. I'll give you a swatch of this yellow. Look at that. That's yellow. <clears throat> that is yellow. Yes, it is. It most certainly is. I almost used this one today. Oh, wow. Hello. Mm. It's the color I was thinking about using. Look at that green. I mean, these colors are so much fun. I'm just watching away. Hey. Okay. Give me one second. <laughs> Oh, it's a nice salmon color. I like that. Okay. Um, that blue, that's, that's swatch it right there. The green is right beside it. The yellow is in front of it. That orange is right there. And the salmon shade, that's at the end. Let's do some more. Let's do the bottom. Oh my goodness. I'll make room. Oh, I love this pink. This is so pretty. Yeah, let's do the bottom shades as well. Oh, this one's not really pigmented like that, huh? Okay. Be good for a transition color. Okay. Some are chalky, I like this purple, but I can, I can work with chalky. I'll make it work. No problem with me, for real. The green is also chalky, but like I said, I'll make it work. You know, you gotta just work with it. I put this black now. Okay. The black is uh, semi chalky as well. It's matte. Okay. That black is very matte. Okay. All right. We're going to start with this pink shade there on the bottom. That's right there. And beside it, you probably can't even see it, is this shade right here. And it probably be a good transition or, or lit shade because. It's really not pigmented like that. The purple is right there. And then you have the green. Oh boy. <laughs> and the black beside it. <laughs> and there you go. And that's LA Colors and Aquatic Paradise. These come on. These are the eye catching eyeshadows. <laughs> and yeah, let's do the Elfin Coffee Bean. The Studio Blush. Blush. Eyeshadow. It's lovely. That is beautiful. Where am I going to put this? Put it under here. I'll make the swatch big enough so you can see it. There you go. Okay, the coffee bean is right underneath there. It's laying across. Right here. Beautiful shades. Oh, for lipstick. I'm wearing this one in 5108. Wet and Wild. Okay. 
swatch some lipstick for you. It's right there. I'll have pictures at the end. And if I forgot anything, I'll include it in the description bar below. Well, this is my look for today. I uh, hope you ladies enjoyed it. Um, well, that's it for now. As I mentioned, there'll be pics at the end, so stay tuned for those and swatches. And stay blessed and beautiful. Ciao. Take care. Mm -hmm. Let me give you another little look. Yeah, I'm going to include pics at the end. Ciao.